it's Sharon from Be Divine Vintage. This week you can actually see me in front of the camera. I'm really excited. I've had a thrifting day and I can say thrifting because uh, we've had a thrift store open in Bolton. Not only a thrift store, it's a thrift superstore. Now normally our shops are called charity shops, as you know, and I've the word thrift I associate with the United States but now we've got a charity slash thrift superstore and they only had hand baskets but they had to nip out to the local supermarket next door and get me a trolley because boy oh boy did I thrift right I'm going to show you I am going to show you my table's full in front of me so I'm going to pop my glasses on so I can actually see and um, off we go. So look at this beauty. Look at that stamp, my mat's here. There's a cup of tea coming in for me. I'm all organized, dogs coming round. You'll hear a feet on the lime floor, limestone floor. Look at that beautiful stamp, one pound. Amazing. Uh, while we're on stamps, I got a Stamping up, still in its box. It doesn't like it's ever been used. Wood effect, one pound. That's like what, 75 cents? I don't know, I don't know. Then, stamping up, never been used. Francais, French writing, one pound. I was like, oh, people were saying, look at her. She's got a trolley, it's full. Well, it wouldn't yours have been. I've got these letters, alphabet letters, stamping up three pounds. Stamping up again. These are the ones I tried to order these and um, I couldn't get them. I couldn't get them, they wouldn't send them from America to me. Three pounds, oh, sorry. No, sorry, three pounds though, three. And then I got this bag. I've not even opened it yet, but there's some big stamps in here. This was 15 pounds. But look at these beautiful um, uh, cherry blossom, never been used. I'm just giving you a little example here of a few of these. Daffodils, it says eight pounds on, but they weren't. They were 15 pounds this bag. Paper craft. Oh, just all sorts. More flowers that are falling on the floor. Deco stamps. So those are hyacinths. So yeah. So from a woman who doesn't stamp to a woman who is going to be doing a lot of stamping. A lot of stamps. So those are my stamps. I got, um, let me pick this up before I stand on it. I like one of those Lego pieces that will just hurt. I got some of this very fine, it's like felt, but very, very fine. It's because I'm going to be making some needle cases. That's on my list of things to do. This, that I think was about 20 pence. 99p, but I haven't bought it for the ornament that it is. I bought it for the bells, because I love them. I'm going to uh, rush them. I've rushed the heart as well. Love those. Scarf, I love the colors of this scarf. It's actually two-tone. It's like gold and a lovely pinky, 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 pinky color and little wispy bits. I'm really into fairies at the moment, so that I thought we might make some nice fairy wings or something. That was a pound. Um, these are, I think they're for round a candle, but what I thought was, for the fairy festival I'm doing later in the year, they make like little lovely little fairy crowns for children if I just sort of put some little I thought I might put some clear um, uh, 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 transparency wings and things on there and some flowers 
I've got one, two, three of those. And I got some mandolina fibers. I've got some thimbles for the little fairy houses that I've been making in thimbles. I got all of these. Two little pots. And I think they're what you would have, these are antique. I'm gonna go antique with these. What you would have put on your dressing table for your cold creams, etc. To store little bits in, in my craft room. I even thought I could even put a fairy village on top of one of these to make like a fairy pot. I don't know. I'll do something with those though. I love them. Did I show you the Angelina fibres? Did I show you them? I think I did. I got these salt and pepper. Now, I thought these would be amazing for glitter. But also, I thought I could even put some little fairies in bottles in those. Because there's air, for room, air rolls for them to breathe. I got a little fairy. That is actually what I went for. I saw it advertised, this thrift store. And, and I saw this little fairy and I thought, I need that little fairy in my life so i went for this but bought all of this so there's my little fairy i bought this but i bought it just for the so i've been doing little fairy villages and things i bought bought it for the plants i got this crackle chroma crackle one pound fifty never been used they're laughing at me and my son's videoing me videoing myself he's gonna send it to my daughters they think i'm daft but um they were like they knew i'd only gone for the fairy and when i came on with all this stuff they were like whoa look at all these most of these are vintage look at those how many seven eight nine ten little bunches of and I particularly like these. It's like made of polymer clay or something. Look at them. Whoa, loads of doilies and things. These need to wash, but you know, we'll wash, but then we'll not probably coffee dye them or tea stain them or something. This piece of embroidery, I know it's out of the middle of something, but I thought I could perhaps make like a cute little like envelope or something out of that i got some cotton some old vintage well this is a vintage cotton because it's stained but hey the stainier the better and some white cotton my son is laughing at me he's, he's in the kitchen cooking so he's just la laughing at me then i got some wow as your mist uh embossing powder and i got some blue ice these are perfect for a project that i'm doing right as we speak well after we've spoken then i got this and it is flower soft i i, I thought it was like um what's it called uh diamond dust even though it says flower soft and it's actually not, it's like little tiny, like little snowflakes. Beautiful. Uh, I'm not getting it out because my husband complained before when it went all over the table. This, guys, this was, oh, just dropped another flower. Right, this was two pounds. One, about one pound fifty. Uh, one dollar fifty cents. Woohoo! Look at the, this, the pages, the paper on this, in this book and this paper that goes over the wedding picture. So no, I'm not getting married again. I've been married, we are happily married and have been for 38 years. No, let's rephrase that. We've been married for 38 years up to now and most of it has been happy. It's all been happy. Challenging happy so that bought for the papers right then look at 
this. Big ideas were born right here. Now these are like for in your bathroom, the bathroom. But I thought they'd be good for putting my envelopes and ephemera and stuff like that in, in my craft room. So I've got eight. I've got eight of these. Got eight. I got this. And look at this. Now what is it for you, Miss? Uh, hanging your jewellery so you fix it to your own you hang your jewellery on it but I thought how great for hanging jewellery on in my craft room yay earrings necklaces so at the minute they're in jars and then you get them out oops sorry I look like I've uh, I've been in prison there you get them out and they're so tangled up you never get them straight again but yeah and it's got little hooks at the bottom so I could even hang little organza bags there with things on so I got of those I got whack, whack, love this little uh, £2.50 <laughs> it's like one of my more expensive items whack, whack, love him um, I got this the chalking board which is put in put your uh, envelopes and things in there but I thought yeah on the wall with my envelopes craft paper fabulous of those one of those this because I liked it and even I have fresh lavender in my garden I just liked it I got oh Oh, I love this jug. This is a vintage jug. Um, it's going to look good that with, with my sweet peas in. I'm going to put it on my window ledge. Oh, if my garden looks like a building site, that's because it is. My husband's doing stuff out there. He's creating a wild, wildflower garden. This, another great container for putting things in. Uh, this little bag now one of my favorite places to shop is east so it's a treat i will go to east online because they shut our east down in our local town so i will go to east online i bought this little bag well no i was looking i thought i'm buying that because i like it i thought i could use it for whatever even if i've I don't know, put crafting materials, whatever in. Anyway, I opened it up. Wham, bam, thank you, ma'am. East. So I was well made up with that. I got myself this little bag because I thought it was cute. This is for me. For me, for spring. We walk a lot. Compass. So we're always losing hours. We lend them to the kids when we go walking and then... Gone. Two little lamps, because we camp lots. Well, we used to do, it's the kids do more camping. Me and my daughter just camp twice, once a year when we do the Lang Allen Fairy Festival, which we are doing this year. So two diddy lamps, because I've got big lamps, so I needed some more lamps. Little tin, brand new, brand new. Not even a pound. Metal cullin whoop, metal colander. Very hard to get hold of these. Uh, yeah, plastic ones. Metal, very difficult. And then here's Percy. Can I say more Percy? This is my beautiful tabby Percy. Oh, these are not mine, these are my daughter's. Hello, Percy. Hello, Percy. There's Percy. And then I got two lots of these. Um, and the fairy lights, but the ladybirds, ladybug. So when I do my fairy festival, I put on my miniature fairy, fairy things, little villages, um, little tiny, um, what are they called? 
I'm just checking if that bulb's in as they have. That's as well, isn't it? Um, little apothecaries and miniatures and things. They'll look really nice on the table. So I've got one, two. I did have to restrain myself. There was four, but I just got two because the lady said, look at her pushing everything in that trolley. And um, yeah, by that time I was a little bit embarrassed. But uh, yeah, had a good day on the old thrift. And um, we'll definitely be back to my thrift superstore. Um, looking forward to going again. Hmm, I'm not time it's all till today. So thank you so much for watching. I will ask my beautiful son, Johnny, to come in and turn off. Because I haven't got a remote. I need an Apple Watch apparently. Bye. Bye.